Intriguing remark from former Vice President Mike Pence saying he would consider testifying before the January 6th committee if he was asked. Tonight, Representative Liz Cheney, the Republican vice chair of that committee, weighing in on that possibility in an exclusive interview. And will former President Trump be asked to testify as well? Here's ABC's chief Washington correspondent, Jonathan Carl. Former Vice President Mike Pence says he would consider testifying before the January 6th committee. And today, that committee's vice chair, Liz Cheney, told me talks are already underway on making that happen. He said this week he's willing or willing to consider testifying if he is asked. Are you going to ask him? So we've been in discussions uh, with his counsel. When the country has been through something as grave as this was, uh, everyone who has information has an obligation to step forward. So uh, I would hope that, that he will do that. So you think we'll see him here in September in this room I before would the hope committee? That, well, uh, I would hope that he, he will understand how important it is uh, for the American people to know uh, every aspect of the truth about what happened that day. No comment tonight from the former vice president. He was right in the middle of it all on January 6th, defying Trump and facing violent threats as a result. Though his top advisors have testified before the committee, Pence himself has been reluctant to talk about what happened that day, sometimes even downplaying it. But now, as he considers his own run for president, Pence says he is ready to open up about what he went through. The American people have a right to know what happened that day. And in the months and years ahead, I'll be telling my story even more frequently. Then there's the question of Donald Trump. Could he be asked to testify too? Cheney did not close the door. I don't want to make any announcements about that uh, this morning. But it's possible you'd, you'd ask him before wrapping up to testify. Uh, yeah, I mean, I don't, I, again, I, I don't want to get in front of uh, committee deliberations about that. I do think it's very important. His interactions with our committee uh, will be under oath. Jonathan Carl joins us now from Washington. And John, if Republicans take over the Congress in midterms, the, the work of the January 6th committee will soon come to a grinding halt. Congresswoman Cheney clearly aware the clock is ticking here. She's keenly aware that time is running out and looking to do all that she can do uh, before the end of this Congress. I would look, uh, Lindsay, for uh, at least two more hearings, potentially uh, high impact, high profile hearings uh, in the fall and, of course, uh, a final report. Jonathan Carl, our thanks to you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.